Hey guys, this is part two of our uh, Omnimons 21's walkthrough slash let's play of Ben 10 Ultimate Alien Cosmic Destruction uh, yeah, Museum in Paris. Um, so in this part, it's a reasonably short one, only 8 minutes or so, I'm not going to keep my videos any longer than that. And I have in fact completed the game currently at the time I'm rating this and it's not going to be more than say 12 parts or something like that. Anyway, uh, just go back and there's some secret items here. There's the full forge charger so you can go into ultimate whenever you want now but I wouldn't recommend to use it until later. You uh, don't defeat most of these guys but they're just, just useful to get hit point uh, to get health and yeah that's about it really So the aim of this part is to get to the top of the museum. It doesn't really matter how fast you take since there's no time limit or anything. And it's also a bit annoying this part since there's loads of bone stuff so you have to get the jumping right. Or you could uh, go as go ghost no big chill and then just fly over which probably would be easier. But it's only a couple of jumps, so you don't really need it. Here, obviously, you monks all can only punch down these things, the walls. But it's also useful to take out other things so they just don't pester you. Humongousaur has a great offense, it's a bit slow but it takes out things a lot easier than a lot of the other aliens. So you're on the cutscene here, um, where the enemy is just running away because he's scared of you and he's trapped a couple of uh, people with fire. And at the time, I didn't know that Swamp Fire could just walk straight through them. So I used Water Hazard to take the water down. And uh, as you'll see, there is the water sign. So you just have to press Y a couple of times as Water Hazard to get rid of the fire. And then you'll be able to rescue the person. Uh, as Swamp Fire, you can walk through the fire and then rescue them as well. But I'm not sure if the fire will go down after the person. Probably will do. But that's just a thing that I didn't know at the time. There are uh, quite a few areas in this place, so I just go through every single one. There might be some hidden items or people you need to rescue. There's six in total, uh, so just go everywhere would be my recommendation. It takes a bit of time to find out where all the things are. Hopefully if you're watching this, you probably know where they are after looking at the video.
there's a uh, spare life and lives are always useful um, in any game really so having extra life is useful there's only one person left and I have missed them and so I will be looking for them and it'll probably take me a couple of minutes maybe a couple of seconds not sure can't really remember and here it is the last person so once you finish this a couple more uh, null void aliens appear and you have to go back to where you were originally before the before you help the people I chose Spider Monkey here just because it's pretty fast and it can climb onto walls, which is useful. Here it is compulsory to defeat the aliens, I think. I'm not 100% but I did anyway. Normally if after you defeat something another one appears it means they're Pass route to fight for you to um, go to the next part of the game. So, for you to ascend to the roof, you must turn into Big Chill and just simply fly up to the next part. Spider Monkey here is useful since it can climb on to stuff easily. <coughs> yeah. Um, as you'll see, I used ultimate here because just to make it easier, I must have been misclicked, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, either way, you, those gold things you should collect, I didn't because I didn't know what they were really for, but at the end of the game, they unlock certain things depending on how many you've got, so if you've got all of them each uh, part, then you will unlock certain things. They're not very, very useful, but some are quite cool. It's like you get free lives, or you can unlock, I think it's Raph as one of the aliens, which is nice. So I'd recommend going getting all of them, even though I didn't, which was not the smartest thing for me to do. I was just interested in completing the game as fast as possible, but not completing the game. Billy, anyway, you are now in a different area, so that will be in the next part. See you in the future.